YouTubers, the new time travel behind me, ADA. I'm back with another video, and today I've got an awesome news for a Doctor Who DVD run for what's coming up in store in the fall 2013, and plus some future Doctor Who DVDs in 2014. So, without further ado, sit back, relax, let's get started. Okay, folks, right here on my computer, we have upcoming releases for September calendar. Next month, we'll see the release of Doctor Who, The Underwater Menace. It stars Patrick Troughton, Deborah Whaling, and Fraser Hines. It's the rare six-part adventure. Sadly to say, episode two and three were destroyed in the BBC archive, but the Doctor Who restoration team and the animation company Quarles will animate the second and third episode. The DVD will also include a VHS link. Let me show you the cover look like for Doctor Who. All right, here's the cover for Patrick Troughton's run. But, let's move on to September 17th. We will see the release of Doctor Who, The Screen of Shaka, starring Richard E. Grant, Derek Jacob, and Sophie Okineno. It says right here, This webcast was ran on BBC's Doctor Who website. It was a pilot for the Ninth Doctor series with Richard E. Grant in a title role. Unfortunately, the series was not taken as the new TV series was taken and was announced. Let me show you the cover of the Scream of Shaka. Yep, here's the cover. I love this one. Fantastic. Then, let's move on to... September 24th, we'll see Doctor Who, the complete seven series. That's right. It will contain 15 blockbuster, I mean 14 blockbuster episodes, plus um, two Doctor Who Christmas specials. We'll see the release of the 2011 Doctor Who, the Doctor, the Willow, and the Wardrobe. Also, the Snowman. But let me show you the cover of the complete seven series. And here's the cover for the UK. And here's the US cover. What do you think? The UK is coming out October 18th. While the US is September 24th. Now, October 8th, we'll see... The long-awaited Fourth Doctor adventure, Terror of the Zygons. This adventure was features the last appearances of Nicholas Courtney as Brigadier Left Bridge Stewart. But don't worry, he'll be back in the Peter Davison adventure, Mordrin on Day, and also marks the final appearances of. Ian Martin as Harry Sullivan. But he'll be back in once more in the Android Evasion. Plus, let me show you the cover. And here's the cover of Terror of the Zygons. The DVD will also include a director's cut of Terror of the Zygon by Stuart Humphrey also known as Babel Color. Also out the same day is the second volume of Doctor Who, The Doctor's Revisit. This time, it'll be focusing on Peter Davison, Colin Baker, Sylvester McCoy, and Paul McGann. It says right here. And it'll be presented in stories, Earthshock, Vengeance of Varos, Remembrance of the Dialect, and the TV movie. And here's the cover. Right here. 
Nice cover. Sadly, it will not be out in the UK. But if you want to get Doctor's Revisit Volume 2, I recommend to get a region free player DVD that you can order to get these to see the revisit. And it also includes a refrigerator magnet for the 5th, 6th, 7th, and 8th Doctors. Plus, coming up in store in early November is Doctor Who Series 1 through 7 Limited Edition Blu-ray set. This will be the first time on Blu-ray for the Series 1 through 4 for the 9th and 10th Doctors. But stay tuned. Series 1 through 4 individually Blu-rays will be coming out in 2014. But let me show you the cover of that. See? Yep. It comes with the remote controlled sonic sc screwdriver. Plus... In November, we'll see the release of Doctor Who, The Moonbase, starring Patrick Troughton. This the earliest four-part adventure. However, episode one and episode three were currently destroyed in the BBC archive. However, it will be combining with animation and the original soundtrack. Let me show you the DVD cover. And here's what the mock-up cover looked like. However, keep in mind, it will be changed for this release. As time goes on. But the UK release, it'll be out sometime in late October to early November. But for Terror of the Zygon, it's a target date for September 30th. So, and for the... Um, Ice, I mean, the Scream of Shaka, September 16th. So keep in mind. Plus, in, on this November, in the early December, we'll see the release of Doctor Who, the 10th Planet. This is the final William Hartnell adventure. Sadly, episode 4 is missing from the BBC archive, but it will be animated by Planet 55 Studios. And if you miss out the revealing cover, let me show you to you again. Here's the cover for the 10th planet. And yes, it will also include a reconstructed of episode 4 it will be a considerate a two DVD set. Plus, now, and also coming out will be the 50th anniversary special, along with the docudrama with Doctor Who Adventures in a Time and Space, starring David Bradley as William Hartnell. That will be included on the DVD as well. But now, the moment you've been waiting for, two Doctor Who's in the works is coming out on DVD in 2014. It's the rare William Hartnell adventure. Do you want to see the cover? Surprise! Here he is, Doctor Who, The Crusades. And here's um, Ian as the Medieval, here's King Lionheart, and here's the first Doctor. Episode 2 and 4 of that story will be animated by Planet 55 Studios. Yes, right. That's the same company who also did The Reign of Terror, The Tenth Planet. So keep the lookout for that. And the moon base as well. That'll be out in 2014. Also, will be in a good candidate for release is the underwater menace. Let me show you the cover. 
Ta-da! Here he is. And here's the cover for that one, too. With the cover episode of episode two of The Underwater Menace and episode three of that story. So, the first and fourth episode will be animated for the DVD release. Plus, it will, plus it got some special edition. However, the rest, I think, the good candidate will re-release is Doctor Who and the Solarians. Now, there has been a problem with the color restoration. Does It was distorted. So, that will be a good candidate for a re-release. And if you don't believe me, well, let me check out the um, the website. Let's see. Let me scroll down here. Uh, yeah. Here's Doctor Who and the Silurians. According to the website, there has been a problem on episode 4 and 5 of the story where cut a color signal on the Betamax tape was ropey due to poor antenna reception that was distorted. What was recorded off from Chicago. So, that means that the third Doctor Serial might be some better restoration treatment for that. So, that's it for this Doctor Who DVD news. If you like to rate, comment, and subscribe, please do so. Shout out goes to Keza Wilkinson. See you next time, folks. Bye for now.